Hello and welcome. You're watching Beyond World is One. My name is Mohammed Saleh, and let's start this broadcast by taking a quick look at what's making headlines in this hour. The Iranian President Ibrahim Raisi claims that acquiring nuclear weapons is not a part of his country's doctrine. The statement has come just days after an Iranian commander had threatened to shift and reconsider the Iranian nuclear policy if Israel continues to threaten Iran's nuclear sites. The Ukraine promptly needs the air defense systems and weapons of sufficient quantity and quality, says Volodymyr Zelensky. He also says that Ukraine has managed to intercept as many as about 34 Russian missiles that were targeted overnight. Ahead of his visit to Israel, the American Secretary of State Anthony Blinken is to reach Riyadh for the World Economic Forum Summit on Sunday. The summit is expected to have a strong focus on the grinding wars in the Gaza Strip. And the Bharatiya Janata Party has fielded the special public prosecutor in the 2611 Mumbai terror attacks case Ujwal Nikam as its candidate from Mumbai North Central. And already grappling with persistent blackouts and food scarcity, Cuba's cash crunch leads to long lines and all the growing frustration outside of banks and ATMs. And South Africa celebrates its 30th anniversary of freedom. President Cyril Ramaphosa praises South Africa's achievements under his party's ANC's leadership. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.